Good morning, guys. It's another week. Hope you guys had a great weekend. And uh, yeah, today's going to be short and sweet. What I would like to talk about is decluttering your digital life. And it's going to be part of a series of designing of or designing your perfect life. Everything from your morning routines to the stuff you do in the evening, during the day, things like that, to just improve your life and make you not only a better designer, but a better person. So yeah, so the thing I've been doing this morning is decluttering my digital life. And what I decided to do, and by pure accident, but I thought this would be a great topic to talk about, is to start deleting a whole bunch of stuff on social media. The good thing to do is clean up your files, go through your social media, you know, and, you know, tidy your, your wall up and things like that. But another great thing to do is to actually go through all the pages that you have liked. A lot of people struggle on social media with the amount of noise that is just kind of pumped their way. And the best thing that I could recommend that they do is declutter the pages that they follow. And what I've done today is go through my pages and actually just start unliking anything that doesn't really, really resonate with me or just stuff I really don't want to hear about. You know, if I haven't gotten true value from these pages, I don't see why I follow them anymore. You know, I'm no longer really in advertising, so I have no need to follow like all the agencies, all of the award shows, all of the brands that I've worked on. It's just noise in my feed. And I think that once cleaning all of this up, it should make it easier to consume information that is maybe more relevant to me right now in my life. You know, will I regret it? Maybe, but I can always go back and like some of those pages. So I'm not too fussed. I'm deleting brands, movies, TV shows, um, musicians, uh, agencies, my own um, pages. I mean, there was a phase where like that was the thing. And so you just got to get like get rid of it. So there's just like so many things that you just got to like clap it and get rid of it and, and move on because it's just so much stuff that you've been following for years. So I'm, I'm seriously committed today to actually um, going through this whole thing and see how it changes uh, the way that I experience Facebook. Because for as much as I try, I'm just not ready to delete Facebook as, as irritated as I get. I just tend to still feel a need to kind of use it as a way of keeping in touch with old friends and birthdays and events that are going on around me and things like that. So yeah, um, guilty. Not ready to delete Facebook. Totally going to get rid of all the pages. As much as it pains me, sometimes you just have to delete Gary the Tooth Fairy. That's it. Finally done. Um, yeah, excited to see how this goes. So as a first thing to declutter your social feed, I'd really encourage you to just go through that entire list and just start unliking anything and everything that really doesn't mean something in your life. And it more than likely will invite a whole lot of other stuff that you're probably not seeing. So guys, have a great week. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, leave a comment and stay cool.